and dying in your beds many years from now, would you be willing to trade all the days from this day to that for one chance, just one chance, to come back here and tell our enemies that they may take our lives, but they'll never take our freedom! Well, very good morning, YouTube watchers. This is Chris, the Flying Scotsman. Hello, and welcome back to the channel. As you know, folks, we've been off the channel for a ooh, good, nearly four weeks coming up to now, uh, with no videos, and I'm always getting comments from all you lovely subscribers going, when's the next video? Why are we missing out? What's going on? What's happening? Where are you? Well, this is just a quick little recap to let you know what's going on. Uh, there's gonna be a, a vlog up, uploaded right now, with uh, a couple of like snippets from the Vista. Now, as a lot of you knew, I, I was away to the Vista for uh, three weeks. Uh, it, was, it was supposed to be two cruises, but then was extended to another cruise. So I had another th week of being on the ship and I only got home last week. So last week I was just getting over jet lag and you know, I've been uploading things on Facebook, Instagram, the usual. Uh, but basically that's what happened. So I stayed for three weeks and I didn't do a lot of filming on the ship. Uh, reason being is it was a brand new ship uh, there was a lot of stuff that I had to learn um, and, and I just didn't feel comfortable uh, vlogging a lot of stuff when I wasn't comfortable myself knowing where everything was. As you know, you were there from the dream from dry dock so I knew exactly how the ship worked. I knew when I could film, I knew when I could do this but with the Vista, it was six and eight day cruises so I didn't know if I could film this day or that day and vice versa. So uh, it's nice to be back. Uh, I've been watching so much YouTube over the last six months, it's been crazy and the channel is growing and growing and I wanna keep growing the channel. Now that I'm on vacation, there's gonna be a lot of big things happening once I'm at home. Uh, number one big thing is the t-shirt situation, as you know, uh, we've got the Flying Scotsman t-shirts that we're going to try and get up and running uh, and of course we're going to link that to Facebook if you are interested in a t-shirt, uh, pop a little comment uh, in the YouTubes to say that you're interested in getting one uh, and it's a cool design, you'll see it, it's a Flying Scotsman t-shirt, uh, you can check that out on my Facebook page, Flying Scotsman CD, for more information. But this is just a little intro video to give you a couple of snippets of the stuff that I got on the Vista. It was it wasn't a lot, I'm not going to lie, it wasn't as much and as detailed as what it could have been, but it was just a little thing. So this is me just letting you know that the vlogs are back, this is day one of getting them back up and running, and this is an intro video, and you're going to now watch the clips of the Vista, and then join me next week for the vlogs where we start the vacation vlog. I'm going to vacation uh, vlog every single day when I'm out and about. All the great things that are happening, the cool things that me and Kimberly are doing. Uh, there's weddings coming up, there's visiting family. You're going to get to see the family on the vlog. You're going to get to meet the Williams clan, which is going to be fun. Uh, so keep tuning in, keep subscribing guys. Remember, drop a like, drop a comment. Uh, follow me on F uh, Flying Scots with CD for Facebook. Instagram, uh, I'm starting to get back on Instagram, of course. Uh, Flying Scots with CD on there. And check out the, the new Chappy Snap or Snapchat, whatever you call it. Uh, check me out on there as well, Flying Scotsman 84. Ladies and gentlemen, keep watching. Uh, this is the Carnival Vista, and this is what happened in my three weeks on board. Boop. Well, this has been a strange vlog this week. Um, I found that I couldn't, I find it hard to, to do a lot of vlogging when I'm, there's a lot of important stuff going on. We got all the stuff together with Matt, the handover. Uh, not even that, it was the lip sync battle took so much of the week, but it was absolutely epic. We did it last night, it was amazing. I had so much fun. I got a bit of a sniffled nose this morning, but as you probably realized, this is my last day. Literally, I'm getting off the ship in about an hour's time and getting ready to go to the Carnival Vista and I'm going to take you on that journey throughout this vlog. I'm going to show you the travel day. 
going through the airport, getting there, hopefully getting everything done, and then getting on the bus start and showing you everything there. So it's going to be a quick transition. Let's go on this journey together. The vlog will be uploaded a little bit later today, but here we go. Let's have some fun. And Vista, here we come. So here I am at the airport. It is raining down, as you can hear, outside. It's pretty bad. Um, I got here in good time. I am sweating buckets. My t-shirt's wet. Um, I'm just waiting to board my flight, so I'm gonna get on the flight, hopefully get straight to Miami. And then of course, I've got to get on board, and I've got to be there just in time for safety briefing, and then start my handover week with the legendary Matt Mitchum. So uh, it's going to be awesome. Um, I'm going to go and sit down now and probably check out some Wi-Fi stuff, and then of course I'll see you on the plane and see how nice and comfy it is. Hello, you may need to open that exit in the event of an emergency. Please read the safety brief for time in the seat pocket in front of you. Contact the flight attendant for reseating. Do not meet the seat requirements. Not wish to operate the exit or you feel you, you may be injured in doing so. Well, hello, Carnival vloggers on board the Carnival Vista. Um, I'm going to try and get some shots of all the cool things going on here. It is a wonderful ship. Beautiful everywhere around. It's so new and like literally so sparkly, like just touching things. Like touch. Oh, it's so sparkling. So, uh, hi there. So just uh, walking around, checking out the things, but look at this. This is the most amazing thing. This wonderful, wonderful atrium. Look at the area of this thing. It's amazing. And then look down there. Oh my goodness. So this is where I'm going to be doing the Motown showdowns and of course all the big parties next week. I'm super excited. I'm really nervous. But um this is this is gonna be it's gonna be good. I'm excited. It's gonna be two weeks. Two weeks of me going crazy, swinging off things and doing my usual stuff. So yeah, I'm actually on my way now to go and get a coffee. Because we are on Grand Cayman and they're getting ready to do they're getting ready to do Dr. Seuss in the afternoon, which is like so cool because I don't do any afternoon. So look, I'm, I'm about to head to the upper promenade, which is quite cool as well. Um, over here's a piano bar. We've also got the art department, which is nice, which is really good. And then you've got another one of these. Look, they're everywhere. Check this one. Look at that. It just moves in its own. It's amazing. Um, over here we've got bonsai sushi. Look at this. What? And then look at the size of the alchemy bar. The alchemy bar is massive. Look at this. So I'm just I'm just still in like complete awe of the place. It's I've never been on a new ship like this. Like I've never been on such a new ship. But here's a photo department. Check this out so you know the old school. And you've got photos everywhere and you know the usual. Look at this. iPads everywhere. So literally you can just like find out your folio number, where your where your photo is. It's so fancy. It's like ridiculously fancy. It's like I feel I feel very upmarket. Um so here we are walking past Red Frog. Check the red frog. And it's got its own brewery. It's got its own brewery, which is like amazing. So yeah, I'm just going to get a coffee, but I'll be back with you soon to show you more of the amazing Carnival Vista. <laughs> so I'm just inside the lounge right now, getting ready to watch Dr. Seuss is on the loose. My favorite event, one of my favorite events that I get to do uh, for Carnival. Uh, I'm watching the legendary Matt Mitchum do it. <laughs> I've All already, right, come on I've in already watched the Ocean Plaza Parade. It was a lot of fun. So I'm now in here getting ready. The theater is gorgeous. It's beautiful. So um, I'll be back with you later to tell you what happened. And of course, more adventures on the Carnival Parade. So here I am, guys. Uh, it's been a long journey to get here. This vlog's going to seem a little bit weird and like all put together last minute, but as you can understand, it has been a crazy couple of days. Uh, leading up from a handover to this has been really hard to, to kind of get through, but I eventually got here and I brought my sneezes with me. Beautiful. Every time. Why do I have a sneezy nose? 
heavy nostrils. I don't know. But um, I got on board. Um, what can I say? Um, I'm I'm super excited. Like I'm j I just feel really privileged, uh, and that's the genuine feeling I have to be given an opportunity like this to come on here and prove myself and show a bigger audience what I can do. I I feel so blessed, and I and I can't thank Carnival enough. I really can't. I'm not going to get emotional, but it means the world to me that I'm doing something that I love and it's starting to be recognised. And yeah, I just want to thank everybody that's that's followed me for the the last few years and still follows me today. It's it's been a it's been an absolute privilege. I've already spent most of a day with with uh, the cruise director on board here, Matt Mitchum, and I feel so blessed to be learning and picking up from the number one in the company who he is just he's just a joy to watch and that for me is a br is a brilliant thing and I, and I just I feed off things like this and it gives me so much excitement to take over and I've always been that way myself and and, I, and I'm just blessed that I get to spend the next six days watching him do his craft um, <clears throat> it's like anything it's like any sporting event when you get to to be in the presence of if you were playing for like a football team and you were the running back but Tom Brady was your quarterback and you learn from that and you watch the way he plays and you watch the way he do it you you pick up things and you pick up traits and and for me that's the way I feel at the moment I feel very very blessed that I'm getting to do this so I'm in the middle of my six day handover uh, I've only done a day so far and it's just been such a whirlwind like meeting everyone and seeing the ship the ship is beautiful but can I can I please say one thing that has made me the happiest bunny in the world. They have a Starbucks on board. Game over. Game over. I've lost my paycheck. My wife's gonna go crazy. I I I have I've lost my money. That's it. Savings gone. I will be wired to the moon with so much caffeine pulsing through my veins because it's Starbucks. Oh, oh, oh. and I try and make it taste bad, but it's so good. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for watching. You know I love every one of you. Thank you for subscribing. And remember, always stay awesome and peace. So there you go, guys. That was the Carnival Vista. It was short. It was sweet. I do apologize. But I couldn't get as much stuff done as I could. Uh, it was just a wild and wacky ship. Let me just say something. Uh, I loved it. Every minute of being on there was, was just amazing. I learned a lot. Uh, it was so nice to get some ideas and stuff that I want to try when I go back to the dream. Um, now, when it comes to the dream, folks, updated, here it is. I'm telling you now from the horse's mouth, this horse is going to give you the information that you need. I will be back on the Carnival Dream on August the 26th. The 26th of August is when I go back and I will be there until December the 3rd. That's the 3 of December. That's my contract because originally I wanted to be home for Christmas and New Year. And I stayed on the Vista, as, you, as I said to you, for an extra cruise. So that knocked up my vacation time as well. So uh, I hope you enjoyed that. Please keep watching the channel. This is it now. This is the start of the vlogs again. Uh, we've got lots of stuff that's going to be happening on vacation. I want to let you in and see what's going on. I want to show you the house. I want to show you the new and improved man cave that I've been spending the last week doing up. It's nearly finished. I am so excited to show you. But uh, yeah, keep watching guys. Um, I really appreciate the likes. I really appreciate the subscriptions. Keep subscribing. And of course, remember, stay awesome. Love you loads. And 